woman that says these three things or four things to you. She's lying to you. Most times when they see it, you see you, you're happy. You're saying, oh, my woman, she praised me today. Something she has never done before. She did it. Especially if they are not really giving you what they're giving, what you're giving them. You say, oh, she praised me today. Ah, let me, let me see if I can do more so that she will keep praising me. She's lying to you. In fact, any woman that says these things to you is not really into you. She's not interested in you. So just leave her the way you met her. This is spell solution. The goal is for you to stay in a healthy relationship and a healthy marriage. Number one is, oh, money doesn't matter. Even your look doesn't matter. I just like you like that. Eh? If she is telling you that money doesn't matter, even your look doesn't matter. It means they matter a lot to her. She has been... And if you watch a woman who says this, you will notice that there is this... There is this attitude she will be showing each time you are outside with her. Most times they don't want to show you off. They don't want to hold your hands, especially when you are in the public. Most times they don't even want to work with you. The same person that told you your look doesn't matter or the money, money is not the problem. The money has always been the problem. She's just like when you are when you are the best option to a woman, she knows you are not what she wants. But she just needs to hang around with you, stay with you, till she really gets what she wants. This is when they start using this words. Oh, money doesn't matter. Your look doesn't matter. Na lie. They matter to her. That is why she's telling you that. She just wants to calm you down. Maybe she has been on and off. She has been giving you this uh, attitude. She has been showing you some different attitude. Maybe when you complain, she will tell you, oh, it's not because of money. Money doesn't even matter. Or even your look. Your look, or you ask her, because most guys can be very funny. You'll be asking her, eh, is it because I don't look fine? Is it because I don't have money? She will always come up with, oh, money doesn't matter. Your look doesn't matter. I lie, you. They matter to her. That is why she's telling you. And you are the best option to her at that time. If you understand that you are the prize as a man, you will know when not to take some things, when to tolerate some things, when to let go of some things, and when to accept them. You will learn how to set boundaries. And if she is telling you, no, I didn't see your message. I didn't see your call. Especially if it is something she has been doing. She kept doing them. Every woman wants to use her phone. It is a pure lie. She's trying to ignore you. Your messages, your calls. She's pretending not to see them. Most times when they want to add spice to these lies, that's when they will tell you, oh my job. They ask us not to use our phones again. They ask us not to touch our phones again. And if you go and check when last she came online, you will see it's just like one minute. Or most times you're sending her that message. She's online. Then you know she's lying to you. If a woman doesn't want to really avoid you, this is only when she starts avoiding your calls, your text messages. She starts avoiding everything that has to do with you. But because she wants you to keep chasing, she doesn't want you to go. She wants to still give you hope that, oh, oh, babe, sorry. Eh, if you don't call, 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 you don't even tire. That's when she will, when you now call again, she will say, Oh, sorry, I didn't see the call. She can be busy and she will tell you she didn't see your call. If it is happening just once in a while and you know, yes, she's busy, yes, she that one cannot be lie. But if it is something you notice with your woman, she keep doing it and she will say, Oh, please, sorry, forgive me, I didn't see your call. It is a lie. She's doing it on purpose because she's trying to avoid your calls. You are a great guy, but, or sometimes they will tell you, you are a very nice guy, but once they use this compliment, you are a great guy, you are a nice guy, oh, you know how to pamper woman, you know how to take care of woman, but this is your greatness, eh, but it's just that your teeth is too long, your hand is too short, you cannot dress well. Once they use that compliment, you are a great guy, and each time they use it, they will add but you are a good guy but knowing that truly in her mind you can be good for all you or all she cares you can be great for all she cares but for her you're not great to her 
it is a typical lie. You are not great in any way great to her. Other women can fancy you. They can see that thing you're doing as you they do well. You'll be, you soji. But she know they see that you're soji. Most times when you're an option to a woman, this is where she uses this compliment. You are a great guy. You are a good guy. You know how to take care of a woman. But this one happened. That one happened. Once she just put but, know with that, all those compliments, she's giving it for a reason. Most times, they don't want to give you clue that they're not really into you or interested in you. That is why they will tell you but, eh, but, know with that she's lying to you. They are lies. Women tell these lies most times to get away with their feelings for you to get away with that they don't like you they don't want you to see it they don't want to give you that clue that oh they don't want they, they're not interested in you they're not into you but they want you to stay focus focus on them chase them most time forget about yourself forget about your goals and your dreams just chase them but at the end of the day you're not they are not with you they will still leave you. And when they want to leave you, they will still make it seem as if they've always been in love with you. But it's you now that is the problem. Most times you start questioning yourself. What did I do? Where did I get it wrong? You're not the problem. From the on go, from the day one, they've never liked you. They are not interested in you. They are not into you. They don't even want you. They're just keeping you there before they get the person they want. So wise up. This is spell solution. The goal is for you to always stay in a healthy relationship and a healthy marriage. Do well to like. Drop your comment what you think about this video. And if you're coming across my channel for the very first time, do well to subscribe. Follow my page for more videos like this. Thank you. Don't forget to share. Many guys need to see and change. They need to be wise. Thank you.